Good morning, welcome to Positano. We are spending the day in Positano today. We're currently staying in Sorrento and this morning we got up nice and early and went to the bus station, it was the train station and the bus station in Sorrento. Bought a ticket to uh, for the Sita, Sita Sud bus that brings you, it goes all the way to Amalfi, which we did the other day. It goes Sorrento, Positano, Amalfi. It costs two euro twenty for a single ticket. Positano on the UNESCO listed Amalfi Coast is famous the world over, especially for this view. There is no doubt that it is stunning. This beautiful cliffside Italian village with its pebbly beachfront, its steep narrow streets that are lined with boutiques and cafes. I mean, it's stunning. It really is a truly stunning place. But I'll share a little bit later on what I thought of our time here. hot today we are here in August well it's beginning of September now but August September we've been here it's the beginning of September now it's extremely hot so our plan is to spend a little bit of time on the beach and in the sea I really want to wander around Positano but right now I feel like it's a little bit too hot to be doing that we'll see in terms of the beach we are on like the free public section it's as you in Positano and look out to sea, it's just on the right hand side. You can just come and use this bit of beach for free. Everywhere else along there's beach clubs where you have to buy um, a sunbed for the day. I think it's 30 euro for a front row bed and 25 euro for anything else. We're just gonna lie here on the sand. All the stones, sand and stones it is. If you would like to receive special perks, including unique badges and emojis, access to members only community posts and early access to every single video, you can do so by clicking the join button down below or there will be a link in the description of this video. Not enough yet, do you go in the sea do you think? section of beach is up pretty busy now when we first arrived it was really quiet like there's only one other person on here but it is about half past 12 now and it is pretty full there's a little snack bar just there i don't know what it sells other than water seems just gone over there to get some water because it's boiling <laughs> 
Do I? Eight? Four. That's not too bad, it's a big bottle, isn't it? Four euro. For one and a half litres. For one and a half litres, yeah, not too bad. leaving the beach now we're heading over we're doing like the little coastal walk over to Cornillo Beach don't know whether we'll sit on it or whether we'll just go and check it out Here's Fonillo Beach. I don't think we're going to go down to it, to be honest. But it looks lovely. Colour that water. Expensive water, 17 euros. <laughs> the prices here are crazy compared to Sorrento. We're now going to go and have a little, a little wander and explore. So, I do think it is a little unfair to judge a place on a day. Let's be real, we're here on a day trip. We've only been here a couple of hours. But my feeling is oh, it is just too busy. There's The streets are too narrow, there's too many people. And I, as I try to wander around, I feel really quite claustrophobic and I don't like it at all. I much prefer the other places around this area that we have visited. You know, possibly at another time of year when it isn't quite so busy, I would feel quite differently about it, but they are my feelings for today. September so we're not in August so we should maybe start but quiet enough maybe not quite but it's just it's just horrific trying to wander around so so busy it's a beautiful place but I don't think August is the time to come or September <laughs> look at all these we're gonna head back to Sorrento on the Sitter Sud bus now my final views after staying for just a day in Positano is as I've been saying throughout this video, yes, it's stunning, yes, it's beautiful, but it's kind of hyped up a lot, I think, to be honest. And like I say, one day is not really necessarily enough to get um, an overall view on the place. And, you know, definitely there's the things around the Positano area, such as the Path of the Gods walk, that I would love to do. I think that would be fantastic. 
And yeah, I just think this time of year is not the time of year to visit Positano. So if you're thinking about it, I would not come in August, beginning of September. 